did an uh, album cover together, the cover for a spanking machine. Their idea was they just wanted to have a bunch of dolls, and they had come up with this huge collection. And that was basically just the starting point. We really didn't know what we were going to do. Photographs are a flat plane, and I loved the idea of shooting against another flat plane to contain the image in a very narrow sort of depth of field, I guess. I had this idea that I wanted to shoot straight down on them, but there's some logistics behind that that you have to figure out. So I was up in the air, probably six feet over them, laying on my stomach, looking down through the scaffolding, centered against the backdrop, and then arranged all of the dolls, and then had them sort of arranged into the photograph. An interviewer asked me, he goes, you know, you're always asked about the replacement roof picture. He goes, what picture would you rather people ask you about? That is the answer to that question, because it was super fun making. That's one of my favorite band portraits, just because it's beautiful. It's got that solid, rested, settled, honest feeling that I really like. And there are a bunch of creepy dolls in it, you know.